there's no expectation of privacy in public. So I'm in a public area. Okay, I prefer that you don't put me on camera. Uh, can I get your name by any chance? Mm -hmm. No, so you don't want to identify yourself? I don't. At all? Nope. You know, I don't want to give you my name. I don't give, I, you don't need to know my name. Oh, I, I don't need to know your name. You don't need to know oh, that, No, I think I do. I think I do. Because I'm speaking to you. I'm a citizen that My has name a right. Is Kelly. Kelly? Yes. Okay. Are you not lying to me, Kelly? Because I'm going to do a. It does matter <laughs> if you're lying. Yes. I don't want to give you my name. <laughs> so so you made up a name then? <laughs> I do make up. I could make up names of people. Okay. Wow, that's so. that's very unprofessional. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. I'm going to videotape first. I thought it was a ride. Then I want to give him my name. Sorry, if it doesn't ride, you should go beat him up. Hello. Hi. Hello there. Hi. How, How are, are you, you today? today? I'm a little hot. It's a little hot. It a little is hot, hot out there. You said your name was Kelly? I am Kelly. Just one moment there. How are you? I'm okay. I'm just wondering if your name is actually Kelly or not. Because... Uh, I, I could go by... You know, people could go by every day. I could be going by another name. Also, okay. Could be going by another name. All right. Okay. Uh, Miss Hope. Yeah. It is Hope, right? Yeah. Um. I just got a, a recently received a FOIA request for everybody's uh, name, title, and salary. Mm -hmm. Um. And I noticed that on that request, Kelly's name isn't on it. So, to my knowledge, she gave me a false name. And I don't appreciate that. Okay. And I'm sorry. And you are I'm your sorry. title. I mean, your title. Oh, so your uh, Rose. Is it Rosemary or? No. No. Why do you I'm sorry. Rose? Because I just said it was Hope too, right? I just said it was Hope. <laughs> hope. La, you know, a Rose by any other yeah. No, there is a Rosemary here. Uh, I believe. I'm just not sure if they're in this particular. Okay. No, I don't mind at all. And I apologize for calling you Rosemary. I keep, even the, even our, our, our first encounter, I kept calling you Rosemary. Because there is a Rosemary here, Rosemary Newton. Uh, but you're Hope Lacrosse, I believe. Hope G. Lacrosse. Okay. Well, you were honest with me and you told me your name. And so did uh, Jocelyn. I believe her last name is Gauthier. Is that how you pronounce it? Close. Close? All right, close enough. Well, she was honest with me and gave me her name. The only person that wasn't honest is quote unquote Kelly, mm -hmm. okay? Not only did she lie to me, which is unacceptable and unprofessional, and remind you, you didn't correct her. You allowed me to leave thinking that she was Kelly. You were part of the conspiracy to keep me from addressing my grievances because you easily could have said, hey, this, this, this is not Kelly, don't, don't lie to this gentleman. Okay, I'm sorry. Because she was attempting to have someone beat me up. I don't care if it was in a jokative manner or not. It was behind my back, so I don't, I don't know if she was being, uh, making a joke or not. It was unprofessional. She was on the clock. She should not be talking about citizens in that manner. And I, don't, I do not appreciate being lied to as well. I wasn't privy to that conversation, so But you were, you were part of the conversation after. After when I told her, when she wouldn't give me her name, you, you, Jocelyn interjected into the conversation. She didn't tell me 
and I asked Jocelyn what her name was. Okay, so you guys are, I haven't filed, excuse me, filed complaints because you're not allowing me to, because you're not giving me her name. So if I, if I put it in writing, what's going to happen? You guys are willing to lie in my face. I can only imagine that you'll just take my complaint and rip it up. So what I would like, because I'm going to wait for, who am I waiting for? The, the senior assessor or the sole assessor. And what's his name? Ron. Ron. Okay. This is, I don't... Yeah. Your name? My name is Good Citizen for the moment. Until you guys give me the respect that I deserve. Hello. Hello. I'm Andrew Kirby with the Supervisor's Office. Okay. I'm just Director of Operations. So can I help you? I'm hoping you can. All right. Uh, I would like to know, because she ran away, what the woman that was sitting right there, what her name is. I did a FOIA request. Okay, she gave me the name Kelly. Kelly is not her name. I do not appreciate being lied to. It is unprofessional and disgusting. Okay, the last time I was here, she joked around. I'm sorry, am I, am I saying something that's wrong? Because you took a deep breath there. No, I'm just, I'm, no, I'm just listening to what you had to say. Okay, all right. No, that, I respect everything you had to do. I'm not trying to get in your way. I'm just listening okay. to what you had to say. All right, well, it seems like people are trying to get in yeah. my way. Okay, right. she told me her name was Kelly. Her name is not Kelly. Miss... Hope Lacrosse, mm -hmm. right? Hope Lacrosse. See, I was able to get those names because she told me the truth. So when I got the, when I finally got the yeah. four-year request, I'm able to be like, okay, this is her title. Yeah, She's, she didn't lie to me. I go to look for Kelly. She's not even there. But I come here. She obviously works here. Mm -hmm. Okay. She threatened to have me beat up by some, I don't even know if they actually work here or not, the person she was conversing with. How can I hold her accountable and file a formal complaint if she's lying to my face, would, would okay. You like to file a complaint for, for what? Under what? For what? Oh, are we are we serious right now? Is that a serious question? No, I'm just asking you. What you say? What, your name no, was Peter. What, what would you what say? Is, like what? Like what complaint? So everything I just said, yeah. you don't know what the okay. complaint is about, really. I don't think you're listening to me, man. I, I noticed that you took that deep breath. I don't know what it is. You guys are obviously aware of me. That's why you got all this new signage and stuff saying employees only be on this point. Okay, I'm not stupid. I wasn't born yesterday. Okay, when a woman tells me that she, her name is Kelly and I go to do a FOIA request and she's not even there. There's no Kelly at all. Okay, how do you think, you think that's acceptable? Someone who works for the public, a public employee, a public servant. Okay, do you think that's okay for her to lie to a citizen, a taxpayer, in their face because she wants to avoid getting in trouble? She should have never threatened me or, th or threatened to have me beat up. So do you think that's okay? I'm not going to comment on that. You're not going to comment? Okay, yeah. okay, well, that's, I don't know if that's the smartest thing, but as a person, you should be able to, uh, a human being, you should be able to comment. You know that's wrong, period. That's why your eyes are fluttering. The situation, the situation right here seems uncomfortable to you. It's not my fault. Blame Miss Kelly, okay? She's the one who was disrespectful. Miss Hope was a part of that disrespectfulness by not correcting Miss Kelly and giving me her actual name, okay? Miss Joyce or Jocelyn, excuse me, Miss Jocelyn. What's her last name, Garther? Or I'm not, I don't know how you pronounce it. I, I know because I got the FOIA request. So I, I'm, I want to figure out what the hell is going on. Because you're obviously not gonna be honest with me. You're gonna be fake, apparently, and not tell me and give me your, your opinion. I, yeah, I'm not gonna give you my of, of course not, of course not. To me, you should, be, you, be, you should be like, oh, that's unacceptable. You should be willing to do whatever it takes to correct the situation. You sound like you don't give a shit. And to me, I'm just saying, based because you ask me, oh, what, what was the complaint about? Dude, I just told you what the complaint was about. She lied to me about who she was. And everybody else was okay with it. She threatened to have me beat up by someone. Do you think that's okay? I'm not commenting on any of I can't comment on any of that. Isn't the, tiny, the town attorney, what is his name? Peter Grummy or Crummy? It's a supervisor. Supervisor, time supervisor. What's his name? Peter what? Crummy? It is crummy? Yep. Okay, well, it seems like there's a lot of crumminess going around here. The treatment is crummy to me. Okay? I don't appreciate it. Okay. I don't like someone looking me in my face and lying to me for no reason, just because they want to avoid accountability. You guys obviously have issues with transparency, apparently, 
Because I come in, she makes an issue about me filming. There's no issue. There's no expectation of privacy, okay? I am a journalist here working on a story. I'm telling them my name. I didn't tell them good citizen when I was first here. I gave them my first name, yeah. okay? I'm sure you're aware of it. I'm sure you know who I am, right? Yeah. You've seen the video, right? I saw your video. Yeah, of yeah. course, yeah. right. It was disgusting. It really was. I wasn't even as upset as I am now. Because when I, got, when I finally, finally got the damn FOIA request, because the town attorney was playing damn games. What's her name? Suzanne? Suzanne? Susan? What's her name? Susan? Susan what? P something? What's her last name? Starts with a P? Pellegrini? Is it? You sound like you don't want to talk to me. You sound like you don't want to say anything. Why not? Why are you here then? Why, is, why the hell are you here then if you're not going to say anything? Okay. Is there anything that can help you other than you want to... You I want the, her damn name. That's what I want. You have her name. No, I don't. In the, in the foil. No, I don't. She told me it was Kelly. What is her name? I'm not... I, I'm not ah, man, you guys are thing. fake. And you're a coward. You're a coward. You, you're yeah. dismissed. You can go. Because you're not here to help me. You're not doing anything for me. You're not even making the, the memorial... The Colony Memorial Town Hall look good. You're not. What are you trying to like? What is your? What does it matter? Goal? What does it matter? Uh, it's not that. What I'm does it matter? My goal is to make sure I get this name, so I can file a formal complaint. I'll file one against you too, if you'd like. I want her name, and I'm entitled to that. She is a public servant, okay? I'll talk. I'll talk with you. You're talking to me about what? Uh, about what? You're gonna talk to me about what and when? <laughs> like, I'm confused, man. Hello, Miss Hope. I just need one more thing when you have a moment. That was uh, Andrew mm -hmm. from, he's director of operations, right? I'm not sure why I, I called him Peter. Uh, see, I, I'm, I'm forgetful like that. You see what I mean? That's I why it's important you, to, to, you to, to have the information. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's like okay you're a good citizen i am i am okay i also introduced myself as daniel the last time i was here okay, okay? So I, I was back there i didn't hear any of that i'm sorry regardless if you heard it or not i wasn't treated properly okay and you were and you were there to witness it you know and she lied to me and you are okay with that i'm not okay with that and i know the citizens that are gonna watch this video are not gonna be okay with that as well. I do not appreciate someone looking to me eye to eye and disrespecting me and lying to me like that. It is unprofessional, it really is disgusting. It shows that you guys got a lot of stuff to hide here. The town supervisor's last name is Crummy and that's what it seems like the behavior is here, Crummy, okay? It is unacceptable. I, I, I really don't know how to, how, like how I can express, express this without cursing at you guys kind of thing. Like that's how disgusted I am. You guys want to treat me with disrespect by not being truthful to me. I want to give you that same disrespect back. Okay. Regardless if it's freedom of speech or not, because it is freedom of speech. But I'm trying to be professional, as professional as I can be. And I am very upset right now. If you're not gonna give me her name, at least have the decency, okay, to do your job and give me her damn title, at least, so I can file a formal complaint because I'm gonna file one, one way or another. I don't care if it has to be her damn picture, okay? And I, I might figure out some, some other legal routes that I need to take because I know I have a right to know who she is. I have a right to petition my grievances to our government and you are keeping me from doing that. You, Ms. Jocelyn, and whoever, her, whoever that person is, Kelly, quote unquote, okay? So please be respectful to me. Do your job and just tell me her position so I know who this woman is. Let me see if the, super, the department head's here. The department head. What is 
I can't remember exactly what your position is. That's why I'm looking at your administrative aid, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And what do you do exactly? Whatever I'm told. <laughs> Whatever you're told, even if it's the lie. No, we don't lie. No, you should. Let me go get. Hold on, on a second. You said we don't lie. That's what you said to me just now? You really looked me in my eyes again mm -hmm. and, and made that comment, made that statement? Okay. Let but me you, go get these. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, how's it going? Hi. Um, you could tell them to tell that, turn that music guy. I really can't hear. What's that? I, that's see you heard you see how I just spoke to you, you couldn't hear me mm. could you tell them to turn that music down so I can converse with you okay I think they're listening very, very, very right we can now. come over I'll here, here. yeah yeah we can come over here there's no problem I'll just come right here I just we could speak in the hallway where it's quieter like you no, know I'm I, 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 the hallway. Just, just, okay so they're right here in your office okay. still go ahead what do you want to what, what is your name Ron Ron yes how's it going good. my name is good citizen yes nice to meet you um I'm here because I wanted to file some complaints, okay, against, I'm hoping you can tell me, who was the woman you're in the, in the office with chatting with? Well, I, She told me her name was Kelly. Yeah. She lied to me in my face. Well, she okay? did. Okay. Yes, I understand. I Do you think you that's okay? I believe you have a request into uh, HR with that, right? Do I? I how how so. can I file a complaint, a proper formal complaint, if I don't have her, her information? Well. I, think you've I don't even have her title. I don't even have her title. Yeah. What is her title? I think you've requested the information of wow. all the, of the people in the town. So you, you know. got something to hide or something? No, you said your name was Ron, right? Yes, my name okay. is Ron. Yes. And your position here is? I'm the assessor for the town. The assessor, the town assessor. Yeah. Okay. And you're going to keep me from being able, from able, you know, so I can petition my grievances to our government. You're going to keep me from doing that? Because yeah. you're not, you're gonna, you're no, gonna violate I, my I First Amendment right. I don't right. know where you stand with all that. That was with a different department. No, no, this is this department. Yeah. Are, is she under you? The woman in question, is she under you? I'm not sure which woman you're talking about. The woman you're in the office with. There's, there's two women. And, and who's, and who are those women? Okay. They work here, right? Yeah. Okay, so their, their names are public information. Yes. What do you have to hide that you're keeping me from being able to hold her accountable with my, with my complaint? I'm not hiding anything. You you are because you no know, because you just said you want to know the woman. I told you there's two people in there. Yeah, the woman yeah. in pink or red, whatever that shirt is. The people in my office. My name is Ron. We yep. have another guy named Chris and Laura. We have uh, Hope and Jocelyn. That I think you've met before, and yep. we have um, uh, we have Jill who goes by Kelly. Oh, so, so we talk about. oh, so she and goes by De Kelly. And there's Deborah. Okay, so finally someone actually was respectful and did not disrespect me. Look at me eye to eye. Yeah. Okay, and you told me the truth because yeah. everybody else has been lying to me. Yeah, well, everybody. I don't know. About so her lying. name is Jill. She was not comfortable being on the camera. That's all. So right. she's comfortable lying on camera? No. I, is no. she comfortable? She seems to be comfortable threatening a citizen, having, oh, you should beat them up for me. Do you think that's, she's comfortable to do that? Do you yeah. think that's okay? I, I don't know about that. You don't know about that? No, no. The director of operations saw the video. So I'm pretty sure you saw the video. If you're, I'm pretty sure you had the conversation with Miss Jill Kelly, however she goes by. Pretty sure you had that conversation with her. Yeah. Well, whatever the director of operations said, that's what the town's policy is. The town's policy is to lie. The I, town's policy is, is to lie. That's what you're saying. No, no. To be deceitful yeah, I'm to sure the citizens. You're working with them right now. I guess you don't know anything right now. I'm working with you right now. I haven't yeah. been able to work with anyone mm -hmm. because she wouldn't give me her information. Yeah because Miss Hope wouldn't give me her information. Mm -hmm. Because Miss Jocelyn, wouldn't, you see how I got their names? Yeah. Because they were respectful to me. Mm -hmm. I came in here and I said, hello, my name is Daniel. How are you today? Mm -hmm. I gave you my information just now. Yeah. That day, I, ha I have nothing to hide. Well, I gave you what, the names of the employees here today. Finally, okay. finally, you, you gave me the name. Her name is Jill, right? Yes. And what's her title? She's an assessment clerk. The assessment clerk. Deborah's assessment clerk. Yep, Deborah Burke yep. is the assess assessment clerk. Yeah. Jill, L what is it, Liberman? Liberman? Sure. Yeah. Sure? No, how do you pronounce it? Because I don't want to butcher her last name. That, that's right, Liberman. You said it right. Liberman, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. I, I appreciate that. See, finally, we get down to the point. Mm -hmm. Okay? I wouldn't have to come here again and do another video if you guys were respectful to me and just told me the truth. Yeah. Well, 
I've told you what you came here to yes. ask. Yes, thank you okay. very much, okay. Ron. I'm not going to take any more of your time okay. unless you want to help me uh, give me your information. Actually, I'm going to need your information because you're her boss, right? Yes. Yes, I'm going to need your information, your email, your business card, so that way I can file my complaint, not only with you, but whoever else. Sure. Town attorney, I'll deal with them in a second. Yeah. Obviously, they, yeah. you know, they're a different section, sure. you know, a different department. So if you can be so kind, I'm going to need your information. That way I can file my grievances. The email for our town uh, assessor's office is infoassessor at colony.org. Okay, infoassessor okay. at, at colony.org? Yes. Okay. All right. All right, yeah, that's pr pretty much it. You guys don't have business cards? I have a business card. So I, I would like it. Yeah, okay, hold on. Right. Yeah, thank you. You know, it's funny, Mr. Ron, because you guys have this piece of paper right here, which I'm going to take one for me, and it says attitude, mm -hmm. right? Isn't that funny? You guys are about attitude, quote unquote, and the attitude that I received that day was sucky. Well, so you probably, you might want to rip this up and come up with something else. Hopefully you got what you needed now, okay? I hope, I hope right. so. <laughs> okay. You'll find out. <laughs> if I come here again filming, then you know I didn't get what I needed. You know? Have a good day. Uh, you too, Ron. Right. Right. Hi there. Hi. How are you? I'm doing horrible. You're doing horribly. Horrible. I'm doing horribly. That's terrible. Yes, it is terrible because Miss Jill Lieberman or Lieberman, she decided to lie to me in my face on my first visit here and tell me that her name was Kelly. She also wanted to ask, uh, I don't know if they were a worker, another worker, or a citizen, if they could beat me up. Oh, goodness. So naturally, I wanted to petition my grievances to our government, but they were keeping me from doing so. Oh. It wouldn't tell me who she, she was, her actual name. By the time I got the FOIA request from you, I could tell that there was no Kelly oh. on that, you know, in the, in the FOIA request. Okay. So I figured I'd come here and pick up a couple... Uh, paper form uh, for your requests because sure. I'm, I'm probably going to need them. Okay. Just give me one second. Let me yes. File this All right. Thank you. You're welcome. And I would like to thank you ladies for being respectful and not giving me a hard time about me exercising my freedom of the press. You know, when I came here last time, you guys were so, so professional. It was so awesome, to be honest. That. And I had Miss Jocelyn right behind me with this negative energy coming in here talking about, oh, he doesn't want to give me... I literally told her that my name was Daniel before we even came over here. Okay, she apparently was just forgetful, which is... I, I, it's okay. I'm very forgetful. Miss Rose right there, I kept calling her Hope. Oh. Even after she told me her name was Rose, I still said Hope. <laughs> you know, so we're human. We are, we are. Um, how many would you like? You said a few. Just two. Just, just two. two. Yes, thank you very much. You're welcome. You and there should be stars. pens really I love you guys. Well, I, I, I really do. That. It sounds weird coming from a stranger. <laughs> hey, you love guys, is love. Where are we going? Yeah, go? Even though I had a horrible you experience remember. the last time, all I could think about is here mm -hmm. and how awesome you guys were. I appreciate really that. Really awesome. Okay. I appreciate that. You give a holler as always if you need anything, okay? Yes, thank you very much. Yep, you bet. Did you stay in here? Thank you, ladies. Have a good day and enjoy the weekend. Get out there and get, and get some of that sun.